Hello world. Uh, today we are going to learn how to extract text from PDF. In the previous two videos, in the first one, we learned how to extract text from images and then we learned how to convert PDF to images in the second video. Now we are going to combine these two uh, and then extract text from images. And for this, we uh, the packages required for this are uh, already described in the previous two videos, so we will not uh, talk about that. So we will directly start coding now. Mm. Uh, without wasting time, let me show you the code directly. If you followed the previous two videos, you are now familiar with this one and this one. Here, uh, using wand, we are reading the PDF file and then we are converting it to JPEG. And here, we open the the image using this um, image module uh, of uh, Python image library and then we are converting it to string using PyTesseract and then we are putting this in this list so uh, here we have two lists image blobs and extracted text the reason is that because uh, this contains a sequence of images so uh, if our PDF contains three pages then there will be three images so we have uh, now you can see that we are converting it to blobs and why we need to do this is because um, for this argument we either um, write the path we give the path uh, to the file or we um, give here uh, in the byte stream format so for this we need uh, to convert um, this uh, format of image to to blob so uh, that is what we are doing here we have um, this is the blob list and uh, we are doing it like this so this is uh, quite simple and uh, the libraries we already talked about both of this and now let me show you um, by running the program let me delete this file save it and now um, it is taking some time because um, it is doing actually uh, two for loops and uh, they are converting first converting it to blob and then in the second one it is converting it to um, using PyTesseract it is converting it uh, to a string um, and then here you can see that uh, since there will be three pages so um, this will uh, give us the the first page so if you want a second page we will replace it by one and then uh, the program is now executed and you can see that uh, it has given us the output um, very nice actually this is one thing that um, is very useful actually I have been looking for things um, earlier um, online I used to uh, for, for doing this kind of thing I used to use some online tools but if you uh, can do it using Python program then it's it's very cool so this is how you do it and 
and see you in the next video.